Hi, Sam. Got any of your classroom stories to share? Yes, I do in fact, I came across a particularly fascinating essay about corporate social responsibility. One of the students mentioned every company besides earning profits, has a role to play in the society. So they invest in various social causes like girl-child education, running orphanages etc. These strategic initiatives by company, is known as CSR. Quite an interesting take, don't you think? Yeah. That would be good, at least they will know how to provide good insights in essays. Don't get me started on the group projects. It is like reading the same essay over and over again. And they even do not consider the various aspects of topics. Exactly my point, Sam. The topic should be tackled from multiple outlooks. Not many students know that they can score those extra marks writing about the disadvantages of CSR, with proper examples. I appreciate a good argument, supported by evidence. So do I. I would love to hear your take on the disadvantages of CSR though. I favor the practice as it gives back a lot to the community. But Sam, CSR activities are tad overrated, don't you think? Mercedes-Benz India partnered with NGO, Grow Trees. 50,000 trees were planted in eight villages of India. A much higher number of trees are cut down by a single company for setting up their units. I would like to differ. I believe that it is useful for the company. That is not coming from a shrewd marketing expert like you. Surely you are aware that carrying out CSR makes costs of operations skyrocket like crazy. Don't you think that the cost will affect the price and quality of their product? If operations costs for CSR are billions, then IKEA would have gone bankrupt, donating. 2.3 million dollars for electricity in Africa and India. They are thriving. If only companies like Nestle took a leaf out of IKEA's book. They continue to risk the biodiversity of the planet, every day. What's even more surprising is that they sweep all their wrongdoings under the CSR rug. Just because a few companies go rogue, it does not mean that the practice should be done away with. In a conscious move, Dell and Coca-Cola recently switched to the use of alternative fuel in their company. Take a closer look at the timing. The automobile companies are giving out one green vehicle after the other, as global cry for environment has boiled up. It is all about profit and publicity, at the end of the day. But you cannot entirely deny the positive impact of these campaigns. Do you know that 68% of the £1,027 million charity received in 2013 and 2014 has come from biggies such as Lloyd, Shell and Tesco? But what about critical sectors like healthcare? There's a lot going on under the veil of CSR at DeVita Kidney Care, like intentionally misguiding patients, so they are forever dependent on DeVita's services. Well, what can I say, your arguments are compelling. But I would say that there are two sides to every coin. CSR is not an exception. You have to weigh in both the sides and provide supporting evidence to back your claims, when writing an assignment. This will secure A grades. You can also avail the writing assistance available at myassignmenthelp.com. Many of my students get their paper proofread by my assignment help for years, I have heard nice things about your citation generators and originality of content. Would you recommend myassignmenthelp.com to students and educators alike then? Oh yes, without a doubt. They have really proved their mettle in such essays. See you around, Beth.